What is up, y'all? Ah! Okay, I'm just a little hyper or whatever. <laughs> anyway, what's up, y'all? This your girl, Go Mouth. I am coming to you guys today. I know y'all been seeing me in the last couple of videos and my hair has been dry. Y'all looking at me outside because I had just did it. And when you first do a relaxer, and my hair is freshly relaxed. Matter of fact, let me go ahead and do a relaxer update video for y'all because this is it, okay? I just relaxed my hair. Um sadly so by the time i put this video up it'll probably be monday or tuesday or whatever i don't know but anyhow as you can see my hair is freshly relaxed this is the second day it hasn't even been 24 hours yet but this is what it looks like after i um go to sleep wake up with my hair up under my bonnet and um this is what my protective my protective style this is what my hair look like freshly relaxed y'all so here's a little limb check this is a long piece i done stretched it because i was in the mirror playing but some parts of my hair have shrunk it shrunk it the, a little more than the others and also i need to clip some of my ends i only clip my i was trying to say this in the video the other day but i only clip my ends hold on let me clean my glasses off because i can't see y'all um i only clip my split ends now okay i do not my goal for me cutting my hair is not to aim for a blunt straight across cut because that is not the way that uh our hair is designed to to like go unless i got a, a piece that's like drastically uneven from the rest then i will not cut my hair to be even even you feel me because when you was born you weren't born with your hair just coming out your head all even in the same length okay so therefore i don't believe you should be chopping your hair off um for a blunt cut okay um so this is my um oh my god see when i turn y'all see how long my hair got i can't scoot over no more i got a rug down here just not let me be great but hold on so um this is what my hair looks like from the back I know y'all be waiting for the back shot, and every time I give y'all a back shot, my hair is getting longer and longer. Every time I give y'all a back shot, child, hold on that stop moving thing. I'll be probably out of out of the focus of the camera. Now, as y'all can see, this is what my hair looks like from the back. Okay. All I did was relax it. Oh, and I threw my relaxer box away, as I always do that before I tell y'all what kind of relaxer I use. I use Optimum Relaxer, okay? Optimum, regular strength relaxer, okay? Optimum. It's in a, it's in a brown box. I believe the box is kind of brownish, reddish brown, and I get it from Walmart, okay? And that's the relaxer that I have been using for last couple of years um i used to use dark and lovely back in the day but they added this keratin treatment in it and i don't like it because it makes my hair too straight one time and i didn't like it um because as you guys know i'm text lax i hope i'm in a good not blurry view for y'all hold on let me see so yeah um my my view wasn't blurry but as you guys know my hair grow longer on this side if y'all can see that it grows longer on this side than it does on this side. Now, I will not, like, I want to give my hair, like, a blunt. Not a blunt, but mostly, like, an even cut so it'll look more fuller at the ends. But, right now, I, I, as you guys are looking at it, some of my hair has sweated out. So, some of it is a little bit more shrunken. Some of my strands are a little bit more shrunk than the other strands. So, that gives my, um, my hair's appearance, you know, with some thinner ends but when i do flat iron my hair or straighten out my hair enough probably flat iron um i, I will be um tending to those ends accordingly okay so but for right now i'm keeping my ends the way they are until i find my scissors then i can do the search and destroy method but um if my ends for some reason get like like start to appear like too 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 thin then i will address that with my scissors shears uh whenever i find them girl because i don't know where they're at i went to um to the store to get some um a while back but i forgot and then 
I shouldn't be behind it because my sh my scissors should be in here. But you know, I be having company and got chillings and things, and people things start walking off and growing legs and stuff like that. Anyhow, um, this is what my hair looks like. No flat iron. This is just blow dried sh blow dried hair. This is not no press. Now, if I flat out my hair, it'll be straighter than this, especially on my ends. Um, but I didn't want to put no extra heat in it at this time. I'm just enjoying the fluffiness and the fullness of my, my hair straight. And I also dyed it, y'all. <sighs> y'all who been rocking with me for a minute, y'all already know this is the kind of dye that I use. Everybody asks me about this all the time. It's Clairol. Beautiful collection. Um, Advanced Gray Solutions. I do... I do have, it went on the flow, I do have gray hair mostly around my edges. And then um, I have gray strands a little bit. Maybe like, I don't know, most of my gray hair is just like right here on the edges. And you probably got three, four, five strands through the back of the hair. But for the most part, my hair is jet black naturally. And it always has been from a little, from a little kid. I was always told, oh, you got some beautiful dark black hair your hair so jet black people used to tell me that all the time so but child you know i had to grow up and get old so then it started from went from jet black to gray <laughs> so anyhow this is what my hair is looking like y'all all freshly uh relaxed okay and i'm gonna break it down for you a little bit too so y'all can see like the different spots in my hair that may or may not need help. Um, I know a lot of y'all probably looking at my ends right now saying, girl, you need to cut it, but hold on. Change is coming. Okay, hold on. Don't you worry. Don't worry about it. Oh, hold on. Okay, so here is my hair. I'm just going to part through because I actually like part through my hair because I like to come back and look at the video. Um... To look at my scalp and all of that stuff and look at the different lengths in my hair because I think it's very important for you to part through your hair so you will know so you will know where your hair needs help at okay it's different parts of people have that needs help more than others some people in you know different parts right okay for instance some people need more help on the edges than they do with this part I mean, overall, you need help on your hair, but sometimes you have hair in different sections that needs a little bit more help. Like me, once upon a time, I needed a whole lot of help back here at my nape, honey. But listen, I've been working on my hair and working on my hair. I got pictures to show you that I didn't have no hair back there, girl. It was just like this. Like this. And it made the whole back side of my hair appear thin until I worked on it and I got it to growing. And now I'm good. Look, let me show you. Okay, I just want to see my progression. I hope I'm not... Okay. I wish I had like a... I could see y'all on this side too. But... And I always comb my hair with a wide tooth comb. So, I'm going to just... My bad, my bad spot in my hair once upon a time. Somebody who been watching my videos for a mighty long time would know that my nape was my bad, the bad part of my hair, okay? Now, as you can see, my nape is just as long as the rest of my hair. Or, if it's not longer than the rest of my hair. Or come close, child. Y'all see that? Um... Not only that, even if I go up, it's different sections in your nape now because <laughs> whew, um, some parts of your nape might be short, some parts of your nape might be long. So you have to get, especially in that nape area, if you got breakage, honey, you might have breakage like right here in this spot. Like that was where my breakage was at, like right there in that spot particular. And you know what I found out? I found out. I actually discovered that my hair in my nape area, it didn't, it's a different, um, 
it's a different curl pattern like right there in that spot in my neck that I was having trouble with and because I relaxed and because I was relaxing the hair that was already um gosh let me say I wouldn't say I'm a 4C hair I might be 4B okay so maybe I got like a 3C section in the back of my head and when you relax the hair that's already straight <laughs> naturally almost not straight but I don't know just a section of my head that just got some straighter hair for some ungodly reason I don't know but I think that was my problem anyway I don't know child that was my conclusion child but anyway we done fixed it now and we ready to go okay so um Listen, y'all, y'all out there and y'all got bonnets from me. Put the bonnets on your head, okay? Keep your hair moisturized, keep your hair sealed, sleep tight, have a good night, okay? If you have not ordered your bonnet today, um, you need to go ahead and order it because I'm not uh, going to be going to the post office as often with all this stuff that's going on, okay? I done told y'all. Um, I'm still going to be going, um... But not as often. I gotta I gotta go at a certain time. I gotta put on the whole armor of God and, and do a lot of prayer before I even walk out this door, okay? So for my safety, because y'all know I'm high risk, um y'all please put in y'all orders now if you wanna or if you're thinking about ordering a bunny. If it don't matter when you put your order in, but I'm just saying I'm going to the post office tomorrow. So if you want to Huh? Anyway, um, I'm going to the post office tomorrow, which is Monday, so I'm probably going to upload this. I got to upload this video tonight. I done did two videos, so if y'all see another video telling y'all the same thing, just know I'll probably be going to the post office again on, i am probably give myself three days a week, because I used to go to the post office pretty much every day. If I got one order, I would run to the post office so that I like. y'all my hope just so loud um so yeah i um i don't forget what i was talking about but anyway <laughs> anyway um if you not if you have not uh, um ordered your bunny or if you've already ordered a bunny for me in the past couple of days, I promise you I'm shipping them out tomorrow. If you order a bunny today, it's coming out tomorrow. If you ordered a bunny yesterday, it's still coming out tomorrow or the day before. I'm um, got to ship tomorrow. Y'all, please um, bear with me because y'all know I'm high risk and there's a lot going on out there in this world. And uh, y'all want me to be safe. And I want y'all to be safe, and I want y'all to be free of sickness and disease, and also the same for myself, okay, y'all? So, um, bear with me with the shipping this time. I, I love, love, love to get y'all stuff to y'all as fast as I can, but right now, we gotta take a little step back, okay? But trust and believe you're still gonna get your stuff. It's gonna come with a, 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 a shipping number, a, a tracking number, an order number, and all of that is gonna come to you directly in your email. As soon as I ship, you will be able to keep up with your uh, tracking and your package, okay? Thank you guys so, so much for um, being there for me, hanging out with me today, and um, supporting me through my journey, okay? Thank you guys so much. All right, now, let me go. I'm going to get hot and tired. I'm going to go fuss at somebody for interrupting my video. All right. All right, y'all. Thank you. That's all I got to say in this video, and I will holler at y'all later. Bye. <laughs>